Let me show you how I presented three design options for the feasibility study of this multi-family residential project using Snaptrude. For the first option, I'm going to generate the program with commercial on the ground floor and some small-sized housing units. Once my program is generated, I'll also make some custom calculations on the cost of construction and gross revenue based on this program. With these automatically generated masses, I can now start designing the massing. For the second option, I'll go with townhouses on the ground floor and a mix of larger sized housing units above. I'll apply my cost of construction and the revenue generated against the number of units. With this automatically generated program and massing, I'll go ahead and design the form. For the third option, I'll go with a mix of commercial and mid-sized housing units. I'll perform the same calculations on my program. Using the generated blocks, I'll design the form of the third option as well. Worth noting here is that all the changes I make while designing are automatically reflected in my program sheet. Now I'll compose my presentation in present mode. I'll bring in a 3D view of the design, a typical floor plan, and my program calculations to the sheet and arrange them with my formatting. Then, I'll do the same for the rest of the options. That's how I create three design options for one MFR project from scratch, without ever having to leave the design canvas. Interested in how this would work for you? Request access on snaptrue.com to know more.